So, I am here to review the uh, Siri on the iPhone 4S. Um, why I don't necessarily use it as much as I would, and um, what can be improved upon. Uh, my biggest gripe is the fact that um, it has to be connected to the internet. Um, I Some people may or may already know that. I did, but uh, I didn't realize how much it would really affect me is that I am on a campus, a uh, college campus that has Wi-Fi pretty much 35 to 50% of the campus is covered with Wi-Fi. Um, inside my dorms, Siri, show me my alarms. You have three alarms. And it shows me the alarms I set. Um, that was really quick. You go and use it outside of Wi-Fi or even um, in a low Wi-Fi area. It has to think, and the response time is so much slower. Um, that's how, that that kind of response time is amazingly fast. Like I was like, oh, why wouldn't you use it all the time? In a case where I'm just walking around, where I would normally use it, uh, you know, in between classes. Uh, walking around, it the response time is so much slower. It's it's really disappointing. Um, even even for something like that, it's like show me my alarms. It it has to think. I think it's sending the signal. It's sending the information and comparing it to a database and bringing it back in, which I wish it was just already installed in the phone necessarily. Even you know you're trying to ask it, you know, something as simple as what's up with your phone, like. Siri, how much memory do I have left? Let me think about that. I can't answer that, but I could search the web for it if you like. See, that's the other thing, is that questions that are related to your phone, um, you know, how much memory do I have left, uh, what's my usage for data, it doesn't collect that information, it doesn't have that. And with someone that something that I would think that it's so a part of the phone, you would think Siri would be able to answer these types of questions. Uh, you wouldn't have to look through your phone and just be like, all right, well I have this much memory or I have this much usage. I probably shouldn't use my my data. Um, another reason why I wish that uh, it wasn't you'd have to connect to the internet because you're using some data. I can't necessarily say how much. Because, like I said, I often connect to the Wi-Fi, so I don't have to worry about that. Um, again, though, with um, if you have a bigger plan, the it's it's a lot slower uh, response time. Even if I have, you know, full bars um, uh, for um, you know trying to ask it a question, and um, I am using data. Um, I'll show you just what I mean here is that oh. so I'll shut off um, I'm gonna shut off my shut off my Wi-Fi which is what I I use oh can I do it there we go I got it uh, and then I'm gonna sh show you that I have my uh, cellular data off. Um, Siri um, also has different um, options. My info, you would you know tell yourself who you are, and uh, you know what you, what you know where you live. Like uh, reminders work really great as far as like you know I'm walking back to class as long as it has some sort of internet connection or. Uh, cellular data connection it picks up where I'm at and reminds me as soon as I get back home so that reminding aspect I use um, I wish wish when I was walking to class I could be like oh r remind me when I get back to my house uh, or back to my dorm that I have to write a two-page paper or I have to do an article review um, and I, I can't necessarily do that you know Especially when it's fresh in your head, you sh you just get out of class, like okay, I can remember that for a little bit of time, and then I'll, I'll just use it here. 
opposed to like being in class and texting and like that kind of looks bad so you wouldn't do that um, so yeah let me show you now um, Fuck you, Siri. Like, be smarter. Connect yourself to yourself. Like, you don't need internet. That's 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 my thinking. Is uh, maybe that's a little asking a little too much, but uh, for me, I think that's one of its biggest limitations. Um, let's see here. What else? That might screw me over for future. Okay, no. Um, what else do I want to say? I was like. Uh, you just be like, what's it like outside? Here's the weather for today through this Tuesday. Everyone says, do I need a raincoat? Fuck that. I'm going to change it up. Do a different goddamn review or say something else that is related. Don't just say what the commercial says. You say everything that the commercial says, and obviously it damn well better work at least. Um, but, you know, switch it up. So I said to ask where, uh, what's the weather like today, and it just gives me... We have a little results. Um, you could do, um, you could do like, oh, uh, uh, one function that I love is that because I'm I'm challenged when it comes to spelling. Um, if I'm texting somebody uh, and like I can't think of a word or I can't think of, um, you know, I like the the spelling for it necessarily uh, for a specific word. Like I'll type text or whatever. And it'll be like, well, actually, like, I can't, I don't know how to spell, uh, I'm trying to think of a word that won't make me look bad. Well, I'll just do beautiful. And then it types beautiful for me. If I can't fucking remember how to spell beautiful or something, like, I can. Alright, fuck you. <laughs> um... I uh, I can just type that in, or if I can't remember how to spell kinesiology, it'll type in. It's not my major. Uh, <laughs> and, um, you can uh, just put that in, and it'll type it in for you. So some sometimes you get scenarios you know, where you don't like, want to look like an idiot, and the autocorrect is good on this, um, but uh, you know it helps to uh, it helps to um, have that little tidbit. That's probably my biggest uh, positive about it. Um, one of my biggest positives. I suck at spelling. Um, also, you can make uh, make note that I have an exam Tuesday. And see, it makes a note that I have an exam Tuesday. Now, I could also say Remind me Tuesday at 4.30 that I have a exam. Here's your reminder for this Tuesday at 4.30 p.m. Shall I create it? No. As you can see, that's pretty badass. That, like, that worked out perfect. And it was so fast. Why the fuck wouldn't I use it all the time? Well... Because when I'm trying to do that, it sits there for two hours, and it's just like, whoa, and it just circles for like two days before it can actually spit out an answer. Actually, most of the time, I don't even get an answer out of it, um, which really just blows because I use that in my dorm, and I'm like, this is fantastic. Now, I can still use it, say, I see on Spire, or I see on, you know, my... Um, my class, like, oh, all of my finals, I'll schedule all my finals, I can see them, I can sit, sit in my dorm and schedule them, but, like, it, it would just be so much better if it could just connect better like that, um, I'm trying to think of another pet peeve that I have with it, um, open Facebook. I can't help you with Facebook, sorry about that. I wanted to open the app Facebook then open it. You can't find it? What, what do you mean you can't find it? You can't help me with Facebook? Like, what the hell? Um, I was surprised about that. Not that I can't push a button, but maybe it's, you know, maybe the app that I'm trying to access is way over there. You know, like, Open SoundCloud.
die. What do you mean you're not allowed? Fuck you. <laughs> also, one thing that's really cool is that I have myself uh, set in as awesome. I, I, that's not really cool that I'm the awesome, but that it, it, it recognizes that. Like, you could be... Uh, Refer to me as genius. I don't know what you mean by refer to me as genius. That was kind of sucky. Uh, call me Jesus. I mean, from now on, I'll call you Jesus, honey. Okay. <laughs> okay, I just laughed, but um. Yeah, you can do stuff like that. It's it's re series really cool. Um, it has a huge potential in the future, uh, for making life easier, uh, and already has made my life easier. Uh, it just could do so much more, uh, without that sort of internet griping. If it, it was more integrated with uh, its um itself in its own statistics, um, uh, like I can still say, um. I can still do something and like remind me tomorrow that I have a test. I already did this. Here's your reminder for tomorrow at 9 a.m. Yeah, I have a test. But um, yeah, like I'm saying, like that would take some time to put in your phone and stuff, and you know, write down. And that's really quick. So yeah, all right. Well, I'm I'm done talking about this. Uh. I got it. I was thrilled to have it. A little disappointed with it. Um, also, if you have nicknames or something like that, uh, one of my friend's names is Bino. Sorry. Sorry. Call Bino. Calling Don Flash One. See. Phone. I don't want it to do that, Don. You know, that's not right. Um, so it also is called like dem and stuff. So I would, I thought that that was gonna work better, but it didn't. Uh, this video is way too fucking long. All right, well I'm done. Um, let me know if you have any questions. Uh, you know, I can ask Siri all sorts of stuff. You can, you can take someone, someone's your friend's phone and get Siri to refer to him as douchebag. Or whatever, um, it's pretty funny. It's uh, it's it's a good, it's a bunch of, it's a really good app and I'm or, or use. It's really I like it a lot. Um, like I said, it can be improved, uh, just like anything can. Um, really anticipating the the new beta, which it is gonna be available for the iPhone 4s. I'm saying that because this is a beta, and you replace a beta with the full version just how it is you don't have a beta on one thing and then keep that the beta and then that doesn't work uh, that's just the typical use um all right well i'm done uh, hope you guys are enjoying your iphones